time you guys are getting into a new relationship with a lady or a girl, you often want to know what her body count is. Now, come on, bro. I mean, do you think that is any woman who will freely open up her body count to you? Mm -mm, of course not. So most times we shall like, we'll be like, you know what, babe? I have slept with two guys, with three guys, with five guys. But in actual sense, my goodness, they are like 10, 20, 30, even 50. Now listen, bro, in this video, I'm going to give you tips that will help you estimate your woman's body count. So assuming this is a woman that you are just getting into a relationship with, these tips will help you estimate or gauge her body count. My name is Pam Oil aka GCP and this is The Men's Love Zone. Here we talk about what to do with love sex and relationships. So make sure to watch up until the end. Like, comment, share, subscribe. <laughs> The very first point on my list today that will confirm that your woman has slept with very many men is if she has a very, very high libido, okay? <laughs> now, I know there are women like me who love SEX so much. Oh my goodness. I mean, we love being drilled mm, most of the time. However, if you have a woman who overly loves SEX, then bro, mm -mm. it could be simply because she has slept with very many men. Now, assuming you have a woman who in the morning you have SEX before she goes to work, when she comes back, before she even does any chores at home, she wants you to give her a cookie. When you are going to bed, she wants to be fucked. And in the morning, same thing, I mean, same routine, then bro, of course, that is too much. Yeah? Now, the reason for this is simply because this woman is used to being drilled. This woman has slept with very many men. This woman has seen all sizes. This woman has seen all variety. This woman has seen all sex position. And that is why she can hardly get enough of your joystick, okay? Again, I am saying that they are women who love SEX, but if you have a woman whose libido, oh my God, is too much that you bang her, bang her, bang her, and she will still want more, even when you are drilling her, you reach a point where you are tired and she's like, oh my God, baby, come on, give me more, give me more. I still want you, baby. I'm not yet satisfied. I can't have enough of you. My goodness. If you have that kind of woman, then bro, mm, there are high chances that she has left with very very many men so mm, you have to be very careful the next sign that can show or that can prove this woman could have slept with very many men is if she never ever gets satisfied in bed mm -hmm. so number one i said if she is a kind who wants to be drilled all the time number two i'm saying if she is the kind of woman who will never ever get satisfied I mean, even if you gave her five rounds, even if you gave her all the sex towels in the world, she will not get satisfied. Now, you need to understand that when it comes to us women, they are sex positions that satisfy us and they are sex positions that we engage in just because we want to satisfy you. For instance, me, oh my gee, personally, I love doggy so much. <laughs> so if a man is with me and he really knows me well and he reaches a point whereby he wants to satisfy me. All he has to do is give me a doggy and voila, before you know it, I will be satisfied. So each and every woman individually has their favorite and the sex styles that satisfy them. Yeah. But if you have this woman who will tell you, baby, I want this position, baby, I want cowgirl, baby, I want to ride you, baby, I want you to give me from behind. But even after doing all this sex position, if still she is not satisfied, then bro, mm, that is a high possibility that this woman oh, has slept with very many men and she cannot just get satisfied. Okay, that has been a point number two. Next sign number three that shows this woman has been drilled with very, very many men is if she is perfect in bed. Perfect in bed. Now, listen, gentlemen, I know that I always keep telling you that as a man, make sure that you advise your woman on how she should be perfect in bed, yeah? And also, if a woman is um, older in age, you know, like, well, of course, that means that, you know, at least she has had sex, sex for a longer time. So she, she is almost perfect, yeah? But if this is a woman who is, say, 25, 28, but 
you realize that she knows all the sex styles and then she is so perfect if she is giving you um cowgirl oh my god she will drill you and she will not get tired i mean she'll drill you and as she's drilling you she's her eyes are glued onto you. I mean, she is so perfect from the way that she screams to the way that she gives you a BG to the way that she sucks your, you know, your everything, your balls, your, your machine gun. I mean, she is literally perfect. Then, bro, bro, <laughs> obviously, this woman has been drilled by very, very many men. Now, again, I'm saying it's very okay for your woman to be perfect i mean i personally keep telling you that your woman at least should be one who can scream your woman should be one who can wiggle her waist properly your woman should be one who can you know make you happy in bed but if this woman is overly perfect guys i mean from the way that she drills you to the way that she will scream your name to the way that she will oh my god next point is if you have a woman who is legit <laughs> now gentlemen I understand that of let most women is legit. In fact, it's very hard for you men to even for a minute believe or even imagine that they are women like Mua who are still trustworthy. Okay. Now, it is understandable if your woman cheats for certain obvious basic reasons. For instance, maybe you are not able to cater for all her financial needs. Um, maybe you are not able to satisfy her in bed. Maybe you are away for a long time, say six months, one year, then it's kind of understandable, okay? But cases where you as a man tries as much as possible to be there for this woman, to fulfill your duties as a man, I mean, you satisfy her in bed, you cater for her needs, you are there for her both physically, emotionally, I mean, you try as much as possible to be available for her, but even at that, you realize that this woman will still cheat at any given time, then bro, there are high chances that this woman is just used to being drilled by very many men. Now, I see most of you, especially if you so much love your woman, you will always try as much as possible to Put an excuse for them. You'll be like, oh, I, I took the blame. Maybe it's because I did ABCD. Probably if I hadn't done this, probably if I haven't, hadn't said that, maybe she wouldn't have cheated. But bro, mm -mm, that is not the case. It's simply because this woman is used to being drilled. So stop covering up for this woman. Now, for instance, it could be that um, you got a phone call and you're supposed to go away or go for a trip for say four days one week and by the time you come back you realize that this woman already cheated on you i mean how can you even explain that it's obvious this woman is just used to this game to being drilled there is no excuse for that point number five reason that can help you confirm that this woman is used to being drilled by very many men or has slept with very many men is if she is the kind of woman who keep comparing you with her exes or with other men mm. now just so you know if a woman is one who is brought up in a good manner from a family that has moral most times a woman would not even want to to show that she has slept with very many men you get but if this is a woman who only will tell you oh so and so performs better than you if it was the other guys they would have already drilled me they would have already made me scream the, the roof off i mean if this woman can boldly say this to you then bro it is obvious that she has all these guts because she has slept with very, very many men. So the next time you are sleeping with your woman or you have you are having sex with your woman and out of the blue she gets up, she, she gets so moody, she is so angry, she starts complaining, you are not doing it very well, you are not getting to the point, I mean, you are not making me orgasm on my G. She literally gets angry, bro. It's simply because she is used to being drilled by other men and that is why she will keep comparing you to other men. Now, just so you know, if a woman has slept with very many men, that means she has all these imaginations of of um the joystick sizes in her head she has all these imaginations of the sex stars in her head so each time she gets down to business with this she will try, she'll keep comparing you with other men so when you drill she's like oh my god the other one has a longer joystick uh so and so would drill me better so and so would make me scream so and so would give me a good 
BG. I mean, she keep having all these comparisons in her head. So, bro, the next time your woman does that, mm -mm, it's because she has been sleeping with very, very many men. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. Those are the points that I wanted to share with you today. And in case you found this video to be educative, entertaining, hopeful, in one way or the other, please be supportive. Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up. Make sure that you leave a comment. And just in case you are watching me for the very first time, oh my goodness, you are more and more and more welcome to this channel you're free to be part of this family and all you have to do is please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to turn on the bell notification so that each time i post youtube will notify you just like that okay and don't forget guys to share this video with your friends and family because when you do that you actually help me to fly and fly and fly and fly and spread my wings thank you guys for watching i love you i appreciate you and i'll see you in my next video. Okay. Ciao, ciao. Bye. <laughs>